What we've got here is example four of solving system of equations by graphing. Okay. Now, anytime I want to solve a system of equations by graphing, I need to graph them both and see where the two lines intersect. So, what let's do is let's get each of these where y is by itself. So on this one, I'm going to subtract 2x on both sides. And that gives me negative y equals negative 2x minus 2. And then I'm going to divide by negative 1 on both sides. And so I have y equals 2x plus 2. So there's one equation. Now on this right equation, you can see that they've already got y almost by itself. The only thing I've got to do is what? Divide, by three. Divide everything by 3. And when I do that, I get y equals 2x plus 2. Right? Yes. And so you can see that this equation right here is exactly the same as that equation. Isn't it? Am I right or wrong? Because right. here's y, and I divided 3 on, on everything so that I could get the y by itself, right? Here's y, and I'm trying to get it by itself. Well, I did, didn't I? And so what you end up with is both equations are exactly the same, right? And so what let's do is let's get a piece of graph paper. And let's graph both of those. Now, they're not even two different lines, are they? They're the same what? Line. Let's graph the red one first. My y-intercept's 2, so I'm going to go up 2. And then my slope is 2 over 1, so I'm going to go up 2 and write 1. Okay? So my, my red line is this line right there. Now, when I go to graph the blue one, I also go up 2 because my y-intercept's 2 and put a point. And I also go up 2 and over 2 and put a point. So when I go to graph my blue one, what do you notice? It's going to sit right on top of the what? <coughs> on, right on top of the red line. Okay, well, if that's true, if the blue one sits right on top of the red one, and I've told you that in system of equations... Where they intersect is the solution. Well, where do these two lines intersect? Everywhere. They touch everywhere. So the answer here is all what? All solutions. Okay? It's all solutions because they intersect everywhere.